Hey ladies and gents, well, I've had to, um, well I've changed over the pool now, so that's all done. Some of the plants are looking a little bit worse for wear, but they'll get over it. They'll pick up pretty quickly. Uh, just waiting for the barley bale to sink. Most of the tannins are out of the water now, so that's good. Um, got all the new plants in here and they've been in now for about a week and they're all going really well so that's all good uh, strawberries are especially going well now um, these strawberries are picking right up and I'm gonna, oh, bugger jeez bloody bugs all right oops hit the car it's only a commodore doesn't matter all right <coughs> so the raptor cage is going to go in here um it's going to be three by three meters that's how tall it's going to be that post goes up to 31.50 high so 3.15 meters uh, that's how tall it's going to be so it's going to be quite tall um, I've just these posts only come in 2.4 so I've welded another meter on the end and uh, there's what is there just over 400 mil in the cement which I've had to dig out which pain in the butt but yeah uh, it doesn't matter though at least I don't have to dig the holes again because I've got the post hole digger here um, I've got a few different size uh, bits for it but I'm going with the, the 200 mil at the moment and geez it oh, tell you what 30 seconds it takes to dig a hole I tried doing that with a crowbar and a pickaxe and a shovel here and it's taken me three days sometimes you get down you know 15 centimeters and then you've got to soak it fill it up with water and let it soak for a day and come back and take another 10 centimeters out and the ground here is just like it's like rock or cement it's just incredible but uh, I've got to weld uh, those two bits onto the ends of these two uh, which I'll do in the morning um, draw all the holes I've cut those lengths of wood to size they're three meters each they'll be the cross beams top and bottom um, there's going to be a double entry door in this side um, where the post is going to go is right about there somewhere and uh, the doorway is going to be here and um, what I'll do is have the double doorway entry there there'll be an area along this side for the sunlight in the mornings to come through um, and the afternoon sun along the north facing side so that will all be good um, I'm also going to plant a lot of natives in here uh, have a water feature area so that uh, they can have a bath if they want to um, a dust bowl area um, for sand baths or dust baths um, yeah I've got a, a good picture in my head anyway about what it's going to be so hopefully that will go good uh, the old uh, parsley there is looking a bit um, 
a bit sick, but it'll pick up again. It's just because everything's just been moved because the whole pool had to come towards me just over a foot. So, um, Oh, I had it absolutely looking beautiful this morning and then I've just pulled down all of this section um, to put the Avery up and moving posts and so forth so I've already started on it but tomorrow I will be getting into it fully and um, getting it all set but it's all starting to come together, all the tools are out here, righty, righty, righty. So, now all I've got to do is get in and do it. Um, bought a good sized roll of wire, 50 metres worth, at least I'll have heaps. 200 bucks for a roll of wire, but crap happens. Um, so, by the time the Avery's up, uh, hopefully all of this should be all back to perfect again. I did lose a couple of fish, um, mainly the silver perch. I think that was because of the tannins in the water from the barley straw. I didn't rinse it and clean it before I put it in. Um, I had other things on my mind and I just didn't think and put it in and paid for it. Silly mistake, but these things happen. So, other than that, everything's going well. Um, heaps of apricots this year, can't wait for that. Mm -hmm. Between all the fruit and veg, it's all good. And I'm going to plant um, passion fruit on the outside of the raptor cage as well. So the little fellas I reckon will be able to start taking flight within the week. So I want it built within the week. Um, I'm going to be pushing but I reckon I can get there. I reckon I can get there all right too. Alrighty guys and girls, I'm going to get going and uh, go and put the front misters on the garden. And uh, actually I'll, I'll move the wrap, uh, move the little mankeen kestrels out the front. And uh, let them have a little bit of a, a bath when I do put the misters on. Um, just so that they can give themselves a bit of a clean. So I'm going to go and do that. Alrighty ladies and gents, I shall catch you later. Bye.